Today, we are going to look at two modern photography masters coming out of Taiwan, Zhang Zhao Tang and Ran Yi Zhong. We'll start with Zhang. He first picked up a camera and began taking photos while he was in high school. During his university days, he learned from a number of modern art theories and movements, including existentialism, surrealism, and the theater of the absurd. And he began to express his own thoughts through photography. In 1965, when Zhang was 22 years old, he and his mentor, Zheng Sangxi, collectively held an exhibition at the Rosemarie Gallery in Taipei. They also used the term modern photography for the first time in Taiwan. Photographing still subjects head-on with purposefully blurred focus is Zhang's trademark technique. It creates a sense of eeriness and horror and amplifies the photograph's visual punch. It is as though the subject within the frame becomes a projection of our subconsciousness. During his more than 50-year career, Zhang's works have included photography, documentaries, and feature films. His works reflect the social shifts in the modern era, and they bear witness to history. Zhang was also involved in the planning and editing of a book series titled Taiwanese Photographers. The series not only plays an important role in passing on knowledge, it also offers inspiration to future photographers. This photo from Taipei Fine Arts Museum's collection is titled Being 5, part of the Being series of photographs that Zhang captured between 1962 and 1970. This photo shows a distant building partially blocked by the shadow of a hand from up close. The juxtaposition of black and white and areas that are in and out of focus creates quite an impact. Let's turn now to Ran Yi Zhong. He was born in Toucheng Township in Yilan County. Ran is a photographer, writer, and publisher. He also founded the Ran Yi Zhong Humanity Award of Photography. Ran joined Echo Magazine in 1969, and that is the point at which he got his start in photography. He soon devoted himself to the craft and began to study the culture of photography. Between 1972 and 1987, Ran published a series of photographs titled People and the Land in Renjian Magazine. The photos show his personal growth and the changes that took place on the land where he grew up, including the radical shifts in economy, culture, and politics. In 1987, Run held a solo exhibition based on the photo series People and the Land. He also published a compilation of these photos in book form. In 1981, Run made a career transition and began producing television programs at TTV Cultural Enterprise Limited. He collaborated with Zhang Zhao Tang, Chinese documentarian Li Xiang, and cinematographer Christopher Doyle in producing TV documentary series on people's lives in Taiwan. The Taipei Fine Arts Museum has collected several of Ran's photos, including People and the Land Li Dao and People and the Land Xu Hai. Ran Yi Zhong has always focused his lens on the connections between the people of Taiwan and the land they inhabit. He has consciously worked to see and to feel this bond between people and their land. And he expressed that bond within the frames of his photographs. Along the way, his photos became an important part of Taiwan's cultural heritage. This is the one common thread that these two photographers share. They did more than expressing personal aesthetics through photography. More importantly, 
they recorded many precious moments of the people of Taiwan.